plus 25 cents. Because we didn't compose it. This is the old report of the American Bar Association in 1958, which uh, showed the progress of communism and communist decisions to interpretations of the United States Supreme Court. That the communists have never lost a case in the United States Supreme Court in 10 years. Do you realize that? Uh, then at the end, we have a broadcast by Mr. Frederick Schlafly of Alton, Illinois, uh, who uh, wrote the Bar Association Report of 1958. And he brings it up to date, showing what has been done since 1958 by the Supreme Court to completely emancipate communists from every kind of congressional scrutiny or punishment. Until today, there isn't anything that Congress can do, according to the latest interpretation of the Supreme Court of the United States, to protect the American people from communist subversion. Do you realize that? Well, if you don't, get this decision and read it. The Communist Party is now legal. When I was in Los Angeles a few weeks ago, I picked up a circular signed by the Communist Party of the United States urging riot and insurrection in what? Now signed by the Communist Party of the United States. Will anybody have any doubt hereafter that disturbances in what are directly traceable to the Communist Party of this country, now protected by Supreme Court decisions set forth in this little volume?